English language teachers are tasked to teach listening skills and help students improve their listening. It's often a neglected part of lessons, and it should be more of a focus for English language teachers. The majority of time during communication and using the skills of English is devoted to the skill of listening. Here are some tips for teachers: things to consider when teaching a lesson with a focus on student listening skills. See the link in the description for more ideas about teaching the skill of listening. One, avoid giving listening tasks where students are required to memorize and recall information. Two, provide images and prompt background knowledge to help student understanding. Three, where possible, use authentic media as listening input. Four, allow students to have a go and listen to a whole passage first without specific tasks. Five, with lower level students, provide same language subtitles to support listening. Six. Employ both top-down and bottom-up processing in a listening lesson. Seven. Promote active listening. Students should be provided specific tasks to complete when listening. Eight. Use video as audio by turning off the image. For additional listenings, turn on the screen to provide context. Nine. Don't give students correct answers right away. Let them listen again. Ten. Listening material should be level appropriate, even if authentic media. Eleven, listening material should be of interest to students and age appropriate. Twelve, if students are having specific problems with listening, take time to identify them and refer students for remedial attention. Thirteen, peers and classmates can provide strong listening material and input. Teach students to listen to each other. Fourteen. Challenge students to listen well and do informal testing frequently. They'll appreciate the feedback. Fifteen, check comprehension with questions that don't require students to memorize or recall information. Sixteen, use open-ended questions to check student understanding. So there you have it. Many tips that might help you improve your teaching of listening. Got your own tip to add? Let us know in the comments. Thanks for listening.